Well, obviously, you know, the facility is awesome here, and uh, we have a great thing to show the kids. But, you know, after a while, when you get to start to recruiting kids, uh, we had a great class coming in last, week, uh, last year, and now the ones we're, we're going for this year is, is really beneficial. Uh, but I think it really comes down to getting to know the people and having relationships with them. I mean, a lot of guys have buildings, just like, you know, getting an education at a university. Everybody has buildings, libraries, professors. You know, it's what you put into it, it's what you're going to get out of it. And we're looking for the right kind of people to come here, and, and that's where we pinpoint our target, our guys for recruiting. How much easier does winning make recruiting? Does it make it easier to reach out and get better reception from? Well, I think they have a little bit of the, hey, we saw you on TV, we saw you here or there. I think it helps, but I think, you know, some of these young kids in, in, in high school, I mean, they think they can walk anywhere and, and hey, I'm going to come in and play, you know. Sometimes I don't think they worry about the, you know, who's won what games or what bowl games have you been in. And I don't think that matters that much, but I do think that when guys come here, I mean, there's a routine that you have to be and you got to go through, you know, a program and, you got to be on time. You got to do everything the way you're supposed to be doing it. And I think that's the kind of guys we're looking for. But I don't think guys say, "Hey, just because you guys went undefeated in the regular season, that hey, we're coming to Iowa." So you're not care. You don't care much about the stars. You care about the players that fit this program, whether they're four stars, whatever. I, it, to, to me, it's very hard for me. I don't, and when I go in and see a kid, if you know, if I'm meeting with a kid, I really don't care about their stars. I have no idea what their stars are, and I really don't care. Uh, but I do care about what kind of kid he is, what kind of character he is, you know, how does he work on the field, what is his demeanor, you know, what is he doing to be the best player, does he have a passion for it, how long does he play? You know, a lot of guys out here don't play very long. So, you know, when they start playing when they're three and four years old, they're invested into it and I know they have some time put into it so it means something to them, has a passion for it. That's what I look for. I'm not worried about the stars, there's a lot of stars out there. That... You, you, uh... Yeah, you use the uh, sound mind, sound body camp as an entry point for a lot of recruits, Desmond being one. Now you guys can't go to that this year. How, what are your feelings in that? You know, I think it's an opportunity for kids, you know, to go out there and compete against each other. You know, does it really matter that we're sitting there as coaches and at that time? I don't know how much that makes a difference. I mean, we knew about guys, you go recruit your area, you have prospect, they have a camp, they come together, they're teaching things. Besides football, I think there's more that sound mind, sound body is about than just, you know, going out and running around, even though there seems, you know, there's a lot of kids that go there. But, I, you know, I really don't, it's good or bad. I mean, it doesn't matter. They, they change the rule next week, then we'll be there, you yeah. know.